Buongiorno, va bene? So, hello, how are you, dears? Welcome back, welcome once again to Visible Makeup. My name is Anneli, and today we're going to review one very, very special perfume that I haven't reviewed. I mean, the brand I haven't reviewed already, so I'm very excited. If you haven't seen, you can go and check out my previous vlog from Capri, from like Italian coast and you will understand why today we're reviewing Cartusia Fomi di Capri So if you so like this like so far, please, if you appreciate my makeup and especially perfume reviews put a thumbs up subscribe tell me what do you think about it give me some feedback and without any further hesitation on me va ai tudo bem ocean ocean or ocean Indeed, uh, je n'ai pas aimé. Voilà. Bonjour. So, I'm even in my Italian mood, wearing wearing my very I don't know. <laughs> it I don't. It just reminds me of Italian boss. I don't know, I love it. I love this very kind of Roman Empire elements and chains inspired by haute couture, so the high fashion, Italian high fashion. So I say, pourquoi pas, why not? I love it. So let's go. So I'm gonna just tell you immediately. Wow. So when I went to Capri, I really, I was thinking like which perfume to get, like what to get with me and I said like no, I cannot wear something which is sweetie, coconut, that's not the vibe of the of the island, that's not the vibe of this part of Italy and also many perfumes are inspired by Italian coast like, uh, like Almafi di Portofino, like Acqua di Joy, we have all these Italian brands or even foreign brands who are inspired by this by the citrusy tones of Italian coast and when I said okay I have to wear something fresh so majority of the time I was wearing uh, Mancera lemon something Mancera yeah lemon by Mancera and Cayali citrus so I was really into the citrus but then by just walking by I discovered something very 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 special it's Cartusia so this is how the bottle looks like, it's very beautiful, I open it, of course, and we can go make a little perfume, I have, oh, there is a like logo here, very beautiful, very chic, and yeah, and absolutely adoring together with packaging which looks like this j'adore and I got this um, paper with the scribes everything and the parfumerie so each of their perfumes is listed here so and then you can find the one that you have and read oh my god I mean, when you enter the store, you can feel some different vibe. It's not like you got into Sephora or any other perfumery. You really enter to the factory. It's the way it seems. So um, there is a little story about it. So it's it is made in Napoli. Here are the names of all the stores uh, that you can find there. Uh, I'm gonna read you something, some like small extract. So only the highest quality products are used and after the fragrance is filtered and distilled to perfection, it is bottled and delicately wrapped by hand in the men's products. The essence contain rosemary hand picked on Monte Solaro while the Capri wild carnation finds its place in the women's fragrances. <gasps> J'adore! Oh my god, and the names, Terra Mia, Via Camer Camerelle, Cartusia Uomo, Numero Uno. So, 
amazing amazing the story about this is very very interesting but let's go to Mediterraneo is their best seller to be honest I didn't know what to what to take because I wanted to take all of them some of them were kind of really too masculine for me and I wanted real lemon even though lemon is a actually universal smell I mean everything is universal smell you can wear anything you want if you like it but I wanted to do something I wanted to something very citrusy something really sign of Italia so let's go mm, you see how it sprays yeah wow okay oh. This is very fresh. This is like a lemonade. For me, I wouldn't call it Mediterraneo. I would call it lemonade. <laughs> it's really like when it's squeezed freshly and you're drinking it. And it's really kind of... It's just... Um, I feel like it's... Um, savon, how to say? It's selling me a dream. Because this is a dream. Like you dream about Italian coast. About all the things you can find there when you smell this so the first note it's very very lemonish i mean i can feel a lot of things going on but first one that hits you is a lemon 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 after i'm sure there is some rosemary and stuff i would say like this but let's read it so today no fragrantica i'm reading from the paper so Mediterraneo, the freshness of lemon leaves mingles with a sparkling note of green tea to create a sun fill and dynamic fragrance. Yep, 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 yep. I would definitely agree. So there is a lot of lemon, green tea. Yeah, and th this is their bestseller. And literally you can use it both for women and the men. Because I would say it's kind of interchangeable. Like boots would work with this. Um, I think it's it's very very interesting uh now i'm still gonna cheat a bit i'm gonna see on fragrantica if they have something oh i still went to fragrantica don't be mad mad i love it so the main accord is citrus of course aromatic of course fresh spicy i would say there is a rosemary yeah this is almost like a lemonade i really want to drink it uh green and fresh definitely 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 Oh my god, it was launched in 2003, so it's been 18 years, wow. Top notes are lemon, so as I told you, bergamot, mint, eucalyptus. So I told you, I told you it's a cocktail. Uh, so then we have red tim, thyme, well, shipper. I, I don't know this, I will have to Google. And middle notes is the Chilean mandarin, wildflower, cardamom, and jasmine base note is white musk okay musk i don't feel here for me it's just freshness even when it stays when it becomes like more um skin scent it's still not it's still fresh it's never warm so uh, it's just lemon lemon it is like lemon mint cocktail almost like mojito but with oh with more lemon in there so longevity is it says mostly weak to moderate sillage it's intimate to moderate ah uh, and i would definitely agree so the main negative point of this is it doesn't last so much i would say projection is three hours and then after three hours it just becomes a skin scent you know you don't feel it so much and that's something that i find really too bad because it's amazing it could be amazing and i don't know i just love it to be like more there to be more present to be more prominent so when i walk that people know oh this lemon is fresh girl and here is um no it's just kind of kind of like shy friend who is there but doesn't want to speak too much so that's the same as my it's it's perfect it's really dreamy i feel italian coast i dream about it again it makes me travel again to this very citrusy beautiful destinations yeah yeah in my head capri is citrusy destination <laughs> even though like uh all the i don't know every everything there it's very very citrusy uh yeah but yeah it doesn't last that's the main issue that I have with lemonish perfumes is they don't last. It's not definitely only reserved only for male or only for female. Anyone can wear it. 
oh my god it's it smells very beautiful and i can feel this tradition italian you know i can feel italia <laughs> i really love it i really love it Cartu and there is also engraviated here cartuza so it's very beautiful i mean this is like piece of art price it was 60 euros so it's okay uh, so i would say it's okay 60 euros for 50 milliliters we are in the middle pra pra you know middle range and they're i believe they're niche because they fabric things on their own they're not part of the bigger company so anyway i am satisfied even though the disadvantage is longevity which is not so prominent but all in all it's a beautiful perfume uh you know it's amazing it's fresh it makes you want to travel mediterranean once again and oh so that's why i love mediterraneo as well so thank you so much for watching this video if you want to hear more about um reviews like this if you want to check out more please go on to my Visval makeup youtube channel et voilà c'est tout pour aujourd'hui merci mille fois on se voit très 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 bientôt see you soon bye